Mabry, if you've driven down Dale Mabry this week, you probably noticed a large tower on the side of the highway. It's all part of Wild 941's annual toy drive for Children's Home Network. ABC Action News reporter Robert Boyd has more on the man who made the tower into a home away from home. Well, radio show host Orlando Davis has been living on top of this three-story tall toy tower all week. We decided to go up there and have him tell us his toy story. Wild 94 One Base Party Station. Freaks have been here. Orlando Davis says it's one thing to do a radio show outdoors in December, 30 feet in the air, but he wanted to take it one step further and live up there. Like cribs on MTV. Everybody wants to get to the bedroom. I zip up probably about 10 o'clock at night when it gets good and cold, and, uh, and then I'm, I'm back at it at, at 5 a.m. For the past nine years, he's dedicated a week on the top of Toy Tower to help raise money, toys, and bikes for the Children's Home Network, serving abused, neglected, or abandoned children. They do an incredible job for 365 days a year for these kids. I mean, they are real uh, advocates for their protection. And so I figure eight days is nothing for me. Davis has learned from experience how to survive. For starters, use the porta potty as little as possible. Just make sure I eat lightly and kind of coast through the week. Also, try not to work up a sweat. There's no shower. I shower with something called Epic Wipes, a handy wipe but it's Orlando sized. <laughs> and have an emergency wave just in case you need help from the hardworking people collecting toys on the ground. They do all the work down there. I just have to hang out up here. The toy drive lasts until Saturday at 5 p.m. Orlando says, don't be a stranger. Show him your support, but more importantly, show the kids that you care. No matter what time of night it is, blow that horn when you're passing me by and lets me know that, that people are with us. In Tampa, Robert Boyd, ABC Action News.